One more game between these two teams, just three meetings this year, April 8th in Boston. That'll be the second night of a back-to-back. -back. In and out, no good. Really good pass there. Over the top to get it out to T.J. Warren, who was on the move. Brad Wanamaker has it. He's in for the first time. He's replaced Walker off the screen as Hayward. And that's blocked by Holiday. And now Hayward for three. Warren misses the jumper. He's just two of five. And now Boston looking for a ten-point lead. Uh, you can see all of a sudden, Gordon Haywood is, is hunting the ball. And he's talking about it and something. He doesn't think, and, and he's got size on something. And that rolls in for Holiday. You've got the two young guards out there. Holiday in his second year. Oh! My! Missed it. Sampson. Oh, he was coming for a bang. And nobody gets back in transition. Sabonis banks it in. He's got 10. In his second year out of Pittsburgh, 30 years old, played in Europe for seven years, and now Tatum drains a three. He's got 11. Jason Tatum. 11 to 2 is the Boston run. Tough shot. Tough shot. You come off the bench and you shoot a three, that's a tough one. But Victor drained that one off the pick by Sabonis. I mean, it was contact. I'm not sure foul is the word I'd use. Warren picked up his first third against the Pacers, and what a shot by Tatum. But that's the shots he's been making, Chris. Yeah. He had five straight 30 point games before the All Star break. He had 41 against the Clippers as Sabonis sneaks through the lane. He's got 12. To Kane Fitzgerald and Wonders, and great now job. Holiday to Great Steve. play by Holiday. Anticipating that one. And Warren scores in transition. He needs to leave it alone, though. Taken by Sabonis. But now Tatum has it back, sets his feet for three, and hits another one. He's got 20. Now he's got Sabonis has him where he wants it. Yeah, he just, that one gets tipped in. TJ Warren to get credit for it. Tyson was right there. Different the post hit. up here. Yeah. Wow. Smart. That is one of the most difficult shots you can take at full speed. And that is unbelievable to be able to stop on a dime like that for Smart. Nice move and a foul. That's Turner against the undersized rookie Grant Williams out of Tennessee. Justin Holiday ready to come back in, and that's Aaron Holiday scoring. Good no call by the official. Smart on the baseline. Finds Tice, who hits the fading jump shot. Yeah, that's just a heck of a play in the last six minutes of the quarter of the half. Pacers over the last nine games, number four in defense of efficiency from another area code. Oladipo for a third time. Just let it go. Shot clock at seven, smart. I'd rather him have the ball in his hand. He makes it. That's a risk you got to take. Oladipo, well, one of three and double figures for the Pacers. Jakar Sampson is in out to set the screen. Oladipo well, hits another three. Game. It's four for four from the three point line. Well, they're going to say it was inside the three. It was a two point shot. Tice. And again, coming back after that horrific injury a couple of years ago, that Sabonis took it right into the chest of Tice. He's two for eight, 0 for four from three point range. Again, in the starting lineup because of the injury now to Brogdon, and Tice rolls it off the glass. Off a terrific pass. Austin 11 of 11, the Pacers 3 of 3, and that's an Indiana turnover. Yeah, because Tatum got his hands on the ball. It's so active. Hayward missed it, but tipped it back in. Nine different teams have shot below 40% this year against the Celtics. Oladipo, Sabonis, left hand. Three and a half minutes going by here in the quarter. Smart. Hayward, corner three. Have their second team foul. Hayward. Won a state championship here for Brownsburg, and he's got 23 10 in the quarter. That was a tough play. Stop on a dime and go straight up. Well, a deep up. 15 continues. To look better and better every time. He's been more of a shooting guard trying to figure out how do I get other people involved. So that's the transition he's making. Nice take by Turner. Again, we continue to see the growth 
in the 23-year-old. Five of their last seven here at Bankers Life Fieldhouse. They've been really good here against the Pacers, including last year in the postseason, as Smart. Sabonis. And the long rebound. Sabonis got it and pounds it home. That's because guys stayed active on the glass, giving you an opportunity. Oh, boy, that, that's the one guy to leave open. Because he can get the shot off faster than anybody else they have on their team. Against the Pacers. Because both of them coming back home. That, that's what coming back home and playing basketball in Indiana means. That's a foul. That's a foul. Miles Turner. Turner. Shoot that at some point. Yeah, that's that link to Tatum. Tyson running. Lobs it up, and Hayward, as as Hayward puts yeah. it in. Well, speaking about the Hoosiers, they're here at the Big Ten Tournament tomorrow night. It starts here at Bankers Life Fieldhouse. Always great to have the Big Ten Tournament here in downtown Indianapolis. The Pacers haven't been able defensively to stop it. They've been able to make some shots. Oh, nice little nice Euro. Nice little Euro. You'll take that by Miles. Savona says Wanamaker goes inside the basket and a foul. What a story, Brad Wanamaker. That he understands where he needs to get shots, how he needs to get them, and he puts your team in a tough position. Oh, what a move by Sabonis to double clutch that. Tatum backs up to use the canter screen. And that's just a big time shot. It, 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 they, partner, you couldn't have said it better. That's a big time shot. He's played 16 minutes off the Pacers bench. Tatum. No good. Canter, the rebound, and a foul. Just 14 points off the bench tonight. Oh, good ball. Warren got it, put it in, and draws the foul. That's a good call. Oladipo, Sabonis two-man game, and tough big shot. shot by Oladipo. He's got 17. That is a tough runner. The Celtic team to score, which they were seemingly doing on almost every possession. Oladipo pulls up. Got it! Got, what a shot! Yeah, he got he got fouled too. Playing his 13th game of the year, and Tatum flushes it home. Bonus 23, Oladipo 20, Warren 19. Uh, good handle, good handle, really good handle. He was able to get that to split. It died. Smart missed it. Pacers have it. Let Victor attack. Oladipo for three. Got it. Let it's Victor a three-point game! Yeah, let Victor, Victor attack. Oladipo! Wanted to give him a live dribble. He is 5 of 5 from 3. Sabonis saves it. Warren to tie it. The Pacers have come all the way back. Sabonis spins against Tice. Pacers have a two-point lead and a foul. Not sure Nate McMillan wanted that shot. No, not at all. And now Tice ties it. You already noted how far down they were. Offense was working for them. Tatum. And he pounds it. They used a good screen there by Tice to get Turner out of the way. He was tired with that, that big three he took. He was tired then, but he was in, in the mood, in the mode. And the Pacers will wrap up Kimball Walker. Chance to give him a four-point lead. Left it short. And he's sitting back down. He didn't sit him down. He just sat down. A three-point lead. And now Oladipo with 13 seconds to play. He's going for the win. Oh, he got to the basket. And Sabonis lays it in with 7.8. Smart comes open. And Sabonis fouls Smart. Nearly had the steal. He had a big smile on his face, but he got the foul first. 113-111. You saw all those close games we've had here. And a three-point lead, and the Pacers use a timeout with seven seconds to play. Comes to... Got to get it in. Sabonis. Justin Holliday. A three. It's short. And that's going to do it with point two on the clock. So the Boston Celtics make it four straight road wins. They snap a two-game losing streak. The Pacers had won eight.